How are you validating your past client successes? We all know that due diligence is a very important part of every buyer's journey. Are you making it easy for your prospective buyers to perform their due diligence by putting your past client successes where they can find them online? If not, you may be inadvertently lengthening your sales cycle and losing deals before you even knew they were an opportunity. In this episode of In Three Steps, we're going to talk about how you can acquire LinkedIn recommendations more efficiently to help your buyers with their due diligence. After every buyer finds a potential business solution, they're always going to want to vet past customer feedback to make sure that they're investing their money in the right places. LinkedIn recommendations provide an ideal place where you can provide that feedback to your prospective buyers for them to review. The challenge that many people face, however, is actually getting their current and past clients to write them a recommendation. Here are some steps that you can take to increase the likelihood that you will get a glowing client testimonial for your LinkedIn profile. Step one, reciprocity. The law of reciprocity simply states that you are more likely to receive value after you have delivered value. Use this to your benefit. Recommendations are also beneficial for your client profiles. So start the process not by simply asking for a recommendation, but by delivering a recommendation. When you simultaneously send both a recommendation and a recommendation request, your success rate will significantly increase. Step two, structure. Don't just simply provide an open-ended request to your clients for a recommendation. Make it easy for them to give you one by providing them a simple structure to follow. Do you have a particular skill or achievement that you'd like highlighted? If so, ask for that to be mentioned. The more structure that you give your clients, the easier it will be for them to deliver you a recommendation in a very timely fashion. Step three, timing. As with many things in life, timing is of the essence. If you close a new client or provide them value only to wait three or six months before asking for a recommendation, the likelihood of you receiving one is significantly diminished. Strike while the iron is hot and ask for a recommendation while the experience is fresh in your client's mind. By following these steps to acquire more LinkedIn recommendations for your profile, you will make it easier for your buyers to perform their due diligence, you will increase your LinkedIn SSI score, and you will drive more targeted traffic to your profile. If you'd like more social selling tips, feel free to join one of our upcoming webinars by registering right here. Thank you for watching this episode of In Three Steps.